Hello and welcome. Here's how to use the web browser on your LG Smart TV. First off, let's locate the browser. Press the home button. Then scroll along to the blue icon with the globe. That is the web browser. Press enter. This loads the web browser. Let's take a look at some of the buttons here. First off, we have new tab. That's the page we are on at the moment. Directly below that, we have a star and this is for the bookmarks you may create. And I'll show you how to create those shortly. Let me show you now, if you click on the star, you have a list. And if you want to delete something from your bookmark list, simply tick it and delete. I'll ask you to confirm, say yes. And that will now have deleted that bookmark. To get out of this page currently, use the back button. If you click X, it will close down the browser. So use the back button. As you can see, I now have two um, favorites here. So moving down, we have recommended sites. These are sites which are recommended that you might be interested in. We have your most visited sites and we have recently closed sites, which you can click open and close again. So we go back to the top of the screen. We have a search bar. Now we can type in a web address or just a search term. If we want to type in a web address, we have some shortcuts here, which save you a bit of time typing, or you can just do a regular search. I'll do a regular search first and press enter. And as you can see, it brings the results here. If I go back from this window, I'll just type in a web address just so you can see how that works. So we'll go with www and we'll just go with BBC. This brings up a web page. And if you look to the right hand side, we have a star. If I click that, it's now added that to my bookmark list. I can confirm that by using the back button here. And looking here, we have the BBC as a bookmark. So that's complete. The next option is this plus sign. Now this gives us a new tab and we can open up many tabs. This will allow us to browse several windows at the same time. When you're finished with a tab, simply press the X button and that will close it. The button here is for the mini player, the mini TV player. If we press this, we get a mini TV. So if you're currently watching something on your television, this will be played here and you can move this around so you can continue to browse the internet and watch your TV show at the same time. When you're finished with that, just press the X. This window here or this uh, button here gives you the full screen, which you can press. And when you're finished, just press exit. This button, as I mentioned, will close down the browser. So this button here is the menu. If we click that, we can go to our history options, which you can press and you can scroll down and see what you have viewed. If you want to delete them all, click on select all and click delete. Another option, if we go to the menu again, is the bookmarks as we've seen. And from here, we can also go to our main settings. Okay, here we have on startup, you can open the new tab page. You can continue where you left off. You can set a home page. Some people like to have Google as their home page when their browser starts. If that's what you would like, simply type in Google here. Click OK. And the next time the browser starts, it will start with google.com rather than the new tab. We have a choice of search engines. You can use Google, Yahoo, or Bing. You can show recommended sites as you saw earlier. You can always show the bookmark bar, which you can select, private browsing, site filtering, um, pop-up blocker, do not track. And at the bottom, you can have clear browsing data. Once you're complete here, I almost did it myself. Don't go for the X, just close the individual windows here. 
If you press VX, it will close the browser. And we are now back to the new tab. What I will do is just close the browser and open it so you can see it open in the, at the new homepage. And there we have it. I hope this helps if you want to know how to use the web browser on your LG Smart TV. Thank you very much for watching.